Hey there, and welcome to episode 2 of The Library, the only show where I try to tackle 838 games and counting. I'm Manny, and today I'm going to play a game that I bought during the latest Steam Summer Sale. The game in question is Deadly Premonition, the Director's Cut. I've heard a lot of things about this game over the years, the most outstanding of which, to me at least, is that it draws some of its inspirations from Twin Peaks. Being a fan of David Lynch's bizarre soap opera myself, I jumped at the opportunity to pick this up for less than a cup of damn good coffee and hot. Now, I've heard some really bad things about this particular port of the game, the most outstanding of which, you can't tweak any graphical settings, including the resolution on a PC game. It leaves it locked at 720p, which is just the most puzzling thing to me. But because the PC gaming community is pretty great, there's a user-made mod by Durante that fixes this. Mind you, this is the same guy who fixed that really shoddy port of Dark Souls a few years ago that had pretty similar problems. I've gone ahead and installed this mod and I'm ready to get weird. It's a ladybug. Oh my God, these children look not healthy. What are you kids looking at? You can't just be looking at trees. Kids don't look at trees that way. What are they looking at? Oh, it's a dead body. They look at it with such longing. I mean, look at that. They're really just soaking that in. <laughs> it's a snake right on cue. He's just, he just knows, knows what's up. Oh man. Oh yeah. This is like the Katamari Damacy soundtrack unplugged or something. God, these children though. They are, I'm just turning the game volume down. Sorry to keep you waiting. It will start soon. This fucking voice acting. It's about time to get started. Could have thought there'd be razors laced Shit. in my nails. Shit. I now have a scar to show off. That you do. And you're all the more anime for it. You see this? I got this when I arrested the cat woman wannabe. Whoa! Oh! <laughs> I need to see if those are monkeys or squirrels, but I'm pretty sure those are squirrels. I mean, there's, you know, there's a fire. Your car's probably gonna blow up any second now. Never you mind any of that. That's okay. You're Francis York Morgan. You've got a cool anime scar because of a Catwoman wannabe. Clearly your priorities are in order, mister. Agent Honor, $30. You think that's how people in the FBI get paid just in Agent Honor bucks? I really like this whole strafing thing it's got going on. What if I just walked like this everywhere I went? Man, but what if I ran this way everywhere I went? Alright. What's happening here? What is happening here? What is... I'm so... Give me control! There we go. Equip weapon, draw with space, draw weapon and aim with mouse. Okay, yeah, I have that under... I, all of that is under control. Literally every single aspect of that. What it... Oh man. come from yes. yes bullseye great i love this this is great so far this is this is everything i wanted this to be oh shooting the butt the butt shot what's this push pushes nope i don't i don't you need it you can stop doing that it's not what i thought would happen oh dear jesus no you stop that right now oh god i get it so I get to tweak my aiming, but then I have to lock on... Man, this is... But I can't commit to the shot if it's up her ass. Is it dead end? Or can I switch to my pipe? I can fucking certainly switch to my pipe. Hell yeah. You tell him, Morgan. Or York. Or Francis York Morgan. Whatever name you want to go by. Really like how it just like... The gunshots are just like... <laughs> just wait, hold on. Wait, ready? Ready? No, you stop it. Stop your your slow shuffling to toward me. You stop it. Stop, stop that shuffling. My 
coffee warned me about it. Yesterday morning, the milk I poured in my coffee made a sign. It said, tomorrow you'll arrive in a place that will change your fate. It happens to me all the time. Okay. So we're stranded in the middle of the side of the road here. So I'm just going to run back. I'm just going to run like a normal person would. Just run back. Totally nothing weird about the way he's running or the way he's moving. Just going to keep doing this. Until I get back to town. Still running. Now you were very late. Totally normal thing, you know. Thing you say to someone who just saw run down the road. FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. Please just call me York. That's what everyone calls me. How do you like my scar? I'm the sheriff. George Woodman. Whoa, Come it's here. like PS2 Danny Trejo. Those are all pictures of things that have happened so far. Bye. Better do it. You better. Better listen to the creepy child. Let's do it. Let's hold our breath. Let's follow let's follow a child in his pajamas. Through a foreboding forest full of red leaves or possibly mulch. This town has what the country needs. Values. Let's head over to the sheriff's department. Whoa! <laughs> That's a lot to soak in right now. Whoa! Man. Oh, man. These car, con these car controls. Here we go. Oh, here we go. Where the fuck am I going? I'm not even going the right way. And this... This dildo is just talking about movies. Am I even going the right way? Oh, man. Nope. Oh, shit. I can do this, I swear. Here we go. I'm parking it. And I'm parking it. <clears throat> Nope. I will tell you about some squirrels I saw in the forest, though. They were monkeying around. This is a good biscuit. I've never tasted a biscuit this delicious. Where in town can I get these? Well, actually... I... Well... I... I baked them myself. <laughs> mm, that's amazing. What are you doing in law enforcement? Very particular about biscuits, I'll have you know. The balance of milk and butter you've achieved here. Oh, my. So I just got done playing Deadly Premonition for about two hours, and that's certainly a game. I didn't hate it whatsoever. I actually dug it quite a bit. I feel like it's hilariously self-aware in what it's trying to do, and it's very obvious that it's got those Twin Peaks influence. It's just hard-coded in there. I mean, I'm probably going to keep playing this game. I actually am enjoying it, and... Kind of want to see what the fuck is going on. The design choices are questionable at best, but it honestly feels like a early Dreamcast days kind of game, but somehow was in last console generation. And, and that's fine. You know, they made it work. It's a dog shit port. I still agree. It crashed on me twice while recording the video. So that made my sphincter clench a little bit and was pinching Adams just like real hard. Got got a video out of it. Got a, got a whole video. I had a, a Delhi Premonition and Director's Cut. I did it. By golly, I did it. Mm -hmm.